And today on Fast and Easy, I'll show you how to make a really healthy recipe for scrambled eggs. Alright, so now we're going to take the butter and we're going to take just a bit because it's not good to have too much butter, this is actually a lot. Right. And we're going to melt it in the pan which is on high heat and we'll move it around like this so it goes over the whole bottom of the pan and our eggs don't stick. And then after this we'll put the eggs. All right. So now we're going to crack the eggs after the butter is melted. And my recipe for scrambled eggs always goes like this. One egg yolk and the rest with egg whites. I'm not a big fan of egg yolk because it has a lot of fat in it. Although my friend behind the camera seems to really like it. So I make three eggs for myself and I have only one with the egg yolk. And I just kind of separate it out like this. Right, so now we're gonna take our Bulgarian cheese. This is white cheese is what they call it here. Um, a very similar cheese to this is Greek feta, but this one's a lot better just so you guys know. Um, so we break it up like this and we just put it all around And this also adds an extra part of protein in the diet, as this cheese contains a lot of protein. So once you put the cheese inside, one of my methods of doing this is just by breaking up all the egg yolks and kind of whisking it around like this, even though this isn't a whisk. But I, I find with the whisk, the cheese gets caught up inside it and it's, it's harder to do. Now once the egg yolk starts to burn at the bottom, you have to just move it around in the pan like this so it unsticks. And that's how you make scrambled eggs. At this stage, when the eggs are almost cooked, you're gonna add just a little spoon like this of paprika. And you'll put it all over like that. And then you mix it around. This gives a nice little spicy taste to the eggs. All right, so once it's finished, you'll see that everything is well mixed together. There's just a bit of yolk left. It should be kind of mushy like this on the inside too. This is why we continue stirring it around. And we separate them into portions like this. All right, so now we're done cooking our scrambled eggs. Thank you for watching and please leave some comments below if you have any suggestions on this. Also one thing I would recommend to eat this with is Bulgarian yogurt and it's in our culture to eat absolutely everything with yogurt. So yeah, thank you so much and come watch again.